let me show you the best storage options for the Series S. I will also leave affiliate links down below in the description to each storage option so you can easily find them if you wish to get a great deal and pick up one for yourself and support the channel at the same time. These mechanical hard drives have a much larger storage space for a low, low price. The only main drawbacks is they are very slow. Think of them running similar to your old Xbox One hard drive. And again, you can't play enhanced for Series X or S games on these drives. You can only store the games there. There is lots of options in these hard drives, but I recommend the Seagate game drive for Xbox as it looks super slick and white, which will match the Series S perfectly. Also has two terabytes of storage and includes one a month of Xbox Game Pass, all for around £60. Next up is the Happy Medium, which is an external SSD drive. I say this is a happy medium because whilst you cannot play Series X and S enhanced games from this drive, you can store them on it and then copy them back and forth between the external SSD and the internal storage in a few seconds like you can see on screen right now. You can play Xbox One games and any backwards compatible games you do will load faster than on a standard Xbox One console drive. I currently use this SSD to store and play Warzone from, so if you've seen any of my Warzone streams, it is running from my external SSD. Being a happy medium is the price, which is far lower than the Seagate storage expansion card, ranging from £50 or dollars up to £100 or dollars, depending on the size of the drive. The storage expansion card for the Xbox Series S and X which is a one terabyte super fast NVMe SSD, just like the SSD inside your Series S right now. The benefit of this is you can store and play everything on it. By this I mean you can store and play Series X and S enhanced games in all their glory from this drive, as well as any Xbox One, 360, or original Xbox games you download from the Microsoft Store or Game Pass. The negative of this storage card is it is very, very expensive. It will cost you £220 in the UK and $220 in the US, basically the same price as the Series S console. If you can pick one up on sale or second hand, it is the best storage you can buy right now for the Xbox Series S. If you have any questions, leave me a comment down below and why not check out some of the best accessories for your Xbox Series S by clicking the card on screen.